Hello guys, what's up? So today I'm gonna show you a very small tip. So basically you've created a timeline and maybe you set a timeline as 4K resolution, 60 frames per second, and then you realize that your clip is actually in 1080p. Yeah, so you have to change that setting on your timeline. If not, there might be problems when you're exporting or your resolution might be not as optimal. So how do you change that? How do you fix this problem? It's very simple. So first, I'd want you to select the timeline itself. For example, this one is one to three. And after that, go to the inspector and under this uh, small icon here, it says show the info inspector and then click on it. And as you can see, that is the so-called timeline resolution they are using and then you can hit modify over here and yep you can change over here to say originally it was 4k resolution and you can change to 1080p and this also applies to other 4k resolutions for example your clip is in other 4k resolution and you've already chosen this one and you want to change resolution setting you can just change it over here and then sadly you can't really change the frames per second setting so you can only downgrade or upgrade your video resolution or else you can actually go to the custom and adjust accordingly but similarly you can't really adjust the frames per second but you can actually adjust the colors over here so if you've already chosen uh, an NTSC color, you can actually change to Rec 709 over here. And if you're using for Instagram, it's very simple if you just choose square, for example this one, and you upgrade to 1080 times 1080p, and voila, it's actually Instagram resolution. And if it does not fit perfectly, it's basically because your video is not 1080p times 1080p you can do it by simply crop it yep like this crop and press done if you want to change the frames per second as well i suggest that you just create a new project and then let me change the project name to new and then remember to change the video format correctly this time 1080p hd you can't really change the color space over here because I've already set it in my default setting and the rates per second I can actually change to 50 which is the actual one of my video and then press OK and this is the new timeline created so I can just go back to the old timeline and copy everything and transfer them over here and it's all done simple and that's all for today's video if you guys like this video please give me a thumbs up if not just drop me a comment so i can improve and if you're wondering why is this video showing because i'm showing support for my friends work uh, they actually made a dance video during chinese new year celebration and I think it's really nice and maybe you guys can check it out and that's all bye bye